Can you believe this? This guy throw throw trash and he just don't don't care. Unbelievable. How that's why they don't like us nowhere. And our man, what's good, everybody? Welcome back to the Lockout Man Podcast Show. Thank you very much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Hey, look, listen, we're just going to go ahead and jump right into this video right here. Shout out to the many of you guys that be sending me these videos in to check it out. This video comes by way of my man, Asian Mai. He talked about this situation. Somebody sent him a video of a truck driver littering all over the place just look at that just look at this mess right here man i mean he just hops out of the truck just don't get the care in the world because he knows that he's being recorded that's right he knows that he's being recorded now just think of it let's let's stop and think for a second for a second all right what if he wasn't being recorded right actually think he would have just left it there of course he would he would he would have just left it right there now did he pick it up afterwards maybe maybe not but he was showing out for the camera because again he knew that he was being recorded can you believe this this guy throw throw trash and he just don't don't care unbelievable how that's why they don't like us nowhere for people like this wow can't believe it i just cannot believe he didn't care he saw me and he doesn't even care unbelievable unbelievable i believe he's gonna be a bonehead tracker Just unbelievable. Hey, eh? unbelievable, my friends. Look, everybody, this is the reason. This, this right here is the main reason. Driver disrespect of of places where we can't park at no more. You know, places like Walmart, for example, where we used to have free range of their parking lot. Park there overnight, get some sleep or go inside and do some shopping. Now, with Walmart, you can't even park on a property. And when you do, you would get a big, fat, juicy ticket. Just a ticket, you're going to get a boot. Not just a boot, you're going to get something that's going to cover the front of your windshield. And, or, and in order to get it taken off, you got to pay an upwards of $1,200. Dollars. Think about that call to your to your safety department slash uh, HR. Hey, I got a boot on my truck, and um, and I need twelve hundred dollars to get it removed. Okay, no problem. We're gonna we we'll get that together. But guess who's gonna have to take care of that bill? <laughs> guess it. You are. You're going to take care of that bill. That's going to come out of your paycheck. You're going to set up some type of, I don't know what you're going to do. You're going to set up some type of arrangement to pay that upwards of $1,200 back, man. And this is the reason why we can't park in Walmart. Now, this is also the reason why TAs, Petros, Flying J's, and Pilots. Say what you want about them charging for parking and upwards of $22 and upwards of $25. Say what you want about that, all right? That they not supposed to be charging drivers to park in their parking lot and they just want to make more money. But yeah, yeah, they can do that. But they also doing that for the simple fact that they got people that goes outside and clean up at the at the at the drivers like this. There's a garbage can right 
behind the truck at majority of these truck stops. Just get out the truck. You're going to have to do a pre-trip or a pre or a post-trip anyway. Why not just take the stuff in your hand and walk to the back of the truck while you post-trip in the truck? Throw the stuff away, come back up to the truck, and sayonara. You don't want to do that. You just want to throw your piss bottles out, your shit bags out, your garbage out, and just, just leave it there for the next man or the next woman to come and clean up after you. I get it. You know, exposing people like this, yes, I'm with it. I'm with it. But see, this driver already knew that he was being recorded anyway. You know, so he's just shucking and jiving for the camera. Now, did he pick his shit up after, you know, dude turn off the camera or whatever, whatever? Maybe. Wouldn't you be embarrassed? Well, obviously he's not. But if somebody's recording you doing some ill shit, well, how would you know somebody's recording you doing some ill shit? You just don't know. <laughs> Unless they blatant with it. And then in this case right here, he's blatant with it. Like, yo, I'm recording you, bro. Look what you're doing. Why don't, why don't you respect the area where we could park at? That's another reason. Let me, let me bring this up before we get up out of here. That's another reason why. Well, I know. Well, no. No, I take that back. I'm not even going to. There's plenty of reasons why we can't uh, park on the on chipper. It's not just only because of that, but but mainly that we can't park in Walmart and other and other prime places that we can park at that we can't no longer park at. This is the reason why. Well, guys, look, if you guys have any videos, questions, comments, or anything like that, send them to me. Hit me up. Hit me up with the you know with the HBO special by hitting that thank you button, that subscribe button, and that like button. This shows that you guys are rocking with the Locked Out Men podcast show. I really do appreciate it. If you guys have anything that you want to contribute, send it to me. You can hit me up two one six six zero zero two zero nine zero, and we can get it out there together. Until next time, everybody, y'all take it easy. Peace. Always wanted to be famous, just being real, yeah, just being honest. My haters won't always be nameless, give them no cloud, I give them no power. Creators of different names. Creation. I'm not new here. Rebo creation.